Now there is a proposal to change the standard for what qualifies as a metropolitan area in the U.S. The Federal Office of Management and Budget wants to double the population required to be considered a metro area from 50,000 people to 100,000. So that standard hasn't changed since the 1950s and it's used to distribute federal money to communities. They want to make the change to better reflect what areas of the country people live in today, but it could present some issues. And they suggest that it's not something that the federal government should be using to define how it spends its money. On the other hand, uh, it is a measure that many agencies in the U.S. government then go ahead and do use to define how they allocate their resources. Now, he says it could affect how much money those communities get from at least 30 federal programs like community block grants, transportation projects, or Medicare reimbursements. At least 144 communities could lose their metropolitan status under this proposal. So to give us some perspective on what that means for us here in Wisconsin, according to the Associated Press, Sheboygan, Oshkosh, Fond du Lac, Wausau Weston and Janesville would all be at risk of losing their metropolitan status. Those cities would be designated micropolitan areas instead. A decision is expected in the next few months.